All right. It feels like we need to have just a little teensy weensy itsy bit of a come to Jesus moment here for some people out there. If you really think that Brock Lesnar, a WWE contracted wrestler who is the company's universal champion on the Raw brand, went rogue style to UFC and went into business for himself, then you are absolutely, totally insane. Completely and totally have lost grip on any shred of reality whatsoever. Ding dong dum dicks! The WWE knew Brock Lesnar was going to be there because they probably helped plan the whole damn thing. And most certainly because it involves Brock. And Vince has this uncanny hard on for this guy. He was in on it. He knew it. And he signed off on it. Because again, it's still so much about trying to get people to like Roman Reigns where they've gotten to the point where they are encouraging Brock Lesnar to hype up a freaking UFC fight to try and get Roman Reigns over. Like, even for the Reigns fans, you know that's the play here. You know that's the whole enchilada here. And you know that's absolutely, completely, totally pathetic. Pathetic. One of the bluest of blue fucks makes you think that that dude is going to evoke sympathy after all this time just because you're going to have Brock Lesnar pretend like he's fucking off WWE so that way you can go fight Daniel Cormier at a UFC fight in the future. God! It's still real to me, damn it! How dare you, Swing Daddy! My flaming keyboard fingers are fire ablaze! I can't believe you would say that! I took just enough time away from New Japan to sit there and da 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 Ah, shut the hell up! It's fake! It was scripted. It was planned. And how pathetic it is that UFC now does professional wrestling better than WWE or any damn body else. That's sad. But what's really sad to me is that what Brock Lesnar did at UFC 200 whatever the fuck was absolutely epic. Where the hell is that Brock Lesnar in WWE? Now think about it. This dude's been back with the company now for three times longer than his first run was. He's been with them over six years. I mean, not totally if you count all the freaking time off, but you get what I'm saying. And you watch on Saturday night as Brock Lesnar walks in looking big and badass with a suit. Looking like a big deal. Looking like a badass. Walking like a badass. Conducting himself like a badass. Even his posture oozed badass. And he proceeds to cut in and cut a promo better than anything Paul freaking Heyman has cut for him for at least the last three damn years. Where the hell is this Brock Lesnar? It's bad enough in today's WWE, you don't get blood, and you get all this other corny crap that makes the crap look faker than it ever has fucking fake looked. You gotta have something that the people can say, I can believe in that. I can feel like that's real. I buy into that. I want to see that. And Brock Lesnar has so many people buzzing about him and Cormier in the freaking future. Part of the reason is, is that he's a bigger draw for UFC than he is a WWE, and that's true, period. But it's because people can buy into the fact he's not sitting there bitching to the authority be like, I want my job with title shot. I want to have a fight pretty please with Suga on top. Well, I've got to get a number one contender's bout first because I need to establish himself. Ah, screw that! He's coming in, he's dominating, he's taking over, he's kicking ass and taking names. That's what the fuck Brock Lesnar should be. How the hell are you going to let UFC do Brock Lesnar better than WWE does Brock Lesnar? Fuck having a Paul Heyman with him. Have Lesnar come out in a suit and talk like this. You can beat that crap out. 
with all the other kitty, stupid, hokey, lazy shit we get. This is something the people can gravitate to. This is something that the people can buy into. This is something that we can believe in. And as WWE fans, you got to go to freaking UFC to see it. It's stupid. It's ridiculous. What the blues and blue fucks is going on here? I want to see that Brock Lesnar. I want to see the true definition of an ass kicker. Of a badass. Not the lazy, no fucks really given WWE version. The kind of somewhat sanitized version at that. The balls to the walls. I'm going to get on top of my wife and drink Coors Light or whatever hell it was because the real sponsor didn't pay shit. That's the Brock Lesnar that people want to see. That's the Brock Lesnar that we can buy into and we can believe in. And that's the Brock Lesnar for however long he's still going to be involved with WWE. The company needs and they need to see really badly. And where the fuck this Brock Lesnar came from. But we need more, more, more of him. Because it would help. And God knows right now we could use some help with the company's product.